Hey y'all, it's Mommy Wata and I am back. Queen of Wands. Did we just do Queen of We just did Queen of Wands. But thank y'all so much for supporting my right botanicals, y'all. We have hit that 10 grand, y'all. Okay. I appreciate everyone who subscribes to my page. And I even appreciate those seven people who unsubscribed to my page after I mentioned on my last video that we had hit 10K. Even though y'all unsubscribed. I still have got enough subscribers to remain at 10K and beyond because what God has for me is for me, no matter how much anyone tries to manipulate it, okay? If he want me to be at 10,000 followers, that's where I'm going to be at, okay? So I appreciate the hate too, just as much as I appreciate the love because it lets me know that I'm doing something right. Aries, you are up. Let's go. Holy Spirit, what are the messages for my Aries Collective at this time, please and thank you, Holy Spirit. What is it that you would like for them to know? Messages from this I Be Knowing Oracle deck. Y'all, we're going to start out with this half of the deck. Because the deck is getting kind of thick. Let's just see what comes out in this half. What type of downloads from the universe does the Holy Spirit have for my Aries Collective? You could be an Aries anywhere in your sun, moon, and rising. You could also be dealing with an Aries. Cross watchers are welcome over here. Let's see, Holy Spirit. What are the messages for my Aries? Please and thank you. Let's go, y'all. Let's see here. They are ashamed. I think we talking about an Aries, y'all. What else, Holy Spirit? I still love you. His poor heart just won't keep still. Divine connection and divine purpose. They are in love. Aries, somebody could be feeling this way about you. Somebody is ashamed of how they treated you. They are still in love with you. They do realize that you and them have a divine connection and a divine purpose, okay? They are ashamed of whatever they did. This connection is currently in limbo. But I feel like this person may be about to move forward to you with no hesitation because they are single now. But they got some spectators in the crowd who can't stop watching and talking about this move that they're planning to make towards you. It could be a whole click of hoes, this gross sister's click energy, who know that this person is coming towards you, Aries, okay? With no hesitation, honey. They ain't wasting no time. They might have been dragging their feet before, okay? But... They not dragging their feet now because they're single. So, so whatever was keeping them away from you, well, I ain't going to say was keeping them away from you, whatever they chose to engage in that kept y'all apart, that's better wording. They have left that behind. And there's a clique of energies who are possibly connected to this person who don't like that this Aries... I'm hearing this is an Aries in this energy. I'm not hearing that that this is an Aries that someone is coming towards. I'm hearing that this is an Aries who feels this way for somebody else. They they are ashamed. They they are ashamed of their behavior towards this energy that they have a divine connection and divine purpose with. They are in love with this person. And now that they're single, they're hoping that they can be with this person. So it's one of the two Aries. We finna see. We gonna clarify more. Any other messages here? Holy Spirit, they don't compare to you. I'm telling you, y'all, it's an Aries who is in this energy about another. They realize who... This other person is. 
some sort of emperor energy. That's what I'm picking up off this Aries card. Let's see, though. Let's see, y'all. Let's stop. Let's, let's get more clarity through the tarot so we can clarify if this is an Aries in this energy or someone is in this energy towards my Aries collective, Holy Spirit. What do you want us to know? Can we get some clarity about this Holy Spirit? Who is in this energy? What's going on here, Holy Spirit? Because the Aries got something to do with it, so... What's up, Holy Spirit? What type of insight and guidance, excuse me, would you like for us to have about this oracle energy, please? And thank you, Holy Spirit. What are the messages? Let's do one more shuffle, y'all. One more shuffle. Clarity, please, and thank you, Holy Spirit. Five of Wands. That's this gross sister's click, child. They pissed that this Aries, I'm telling you, want to come towards a divine feminine. This is his divine connection and divine purpose. There's a, a community of women who are upset that this Aries energy wants to come towards this Empress here because that means he broke the heart of another. He had left somebody else behind. If he coming towards this empress to give her an offer and have a victory with her like he's hoping to do in the future. Okay? So there are people who are upset that he took this action and they're watching. They're waiting to see how this plays out. But this Aries don't give a fuck about... This Aries in the Six of Wands, child. He don't care. They fighting over there with amongst themselves because they not fighting with this Aries. This Aries is going this way. He he in a whole another zone. He he got tunnel vision going on. No hesitation. He don't give a fuck about what this five of wands community think about the action that he's taking to have this ten of pentacles partnership with you. They can talk about it and watch all they want to. That's the Six of Wands vibe here. Sitting on that horse like that. He know people peeping what he doing, but he don't care. What else, Holy Spirit? Ace of Cups. Because he is in love with this Empress. Okay? And he's ashamed of how he mistreated this Empress to please this Five of Wands community. This man faced some sort of judgment for how he treated this empress here. Aries energy is about, Aries emperor energy is about establishing law and order, getting things in alignment, laying the law down even, obtaining and demanding at times your respect. Nine of Wands. This man was not in this energy before. That's why this in limbo came out here. That's why this they are ashamed came out here. Because he was allowing himself to participate in some sort of action against this empress. Even if that action was just as simple as rejecting her. I ain't saying, I'm not really picking up this man went on no slander campaign against this woman or nothing like that, like in that King of Wands reading. Whoever this is, he just rejected you, okay? This is a four cross watcher here, child. Three of Cups, Five of Pentacles. He could have celebrated with you, but he chose a low vibrational connection instead. And that's what he's walking away from. This man is, ain't no was walking away from. He didn't already moved on from this six of swords. He's single. He definitely has switched it up here with this wheel of fortune. Okay? So now they're trying to see where this Aries is going, this wand energy. He is out here. It's the six of wands and this nine of wands. He on his way towards you, but he is... 
he ashamed. He he's questioning if you still love him. He's hoping that you do. I can't believe I just switched to talking to the person. So this cross watcher energy is heavy. But I welcome all cross watchers because the way my readings come out, they come out sometimes for the cross watcher to get insight on the person that they're with, on what they need to know about who they're dealing with, about who they choose to give to and receive from. And this man has changed his mind about who he wants to give to and receive from. He no longer wants anything from this gross sister's clique and the woman who was attached to it. It's really given like he was in a partnership with someone, whoever this five of pentacles is, and it was one of those vibes like, if you date me, you date my family too. Something like that here. Like she got a clique of cousins and friends and possibly even sisters who are heavily involved in her life, including her relationship, 1111. And I feel like in this man trying to be in this partnership with this five of pentacles, he was trying to please this five of wands too, this community of hers. That's why they're so heavily invested in his forward movement as well. She, he was with one of them type of women and families, okay? They so invested in, who, in him re, reconnecting with this empress because they all were heavily involved in his partnership with this five of pentacles. But this man knows who you are. Six of Cups is falling right up under your energy. He knows that you are some sort of past life soulmate. And he's going to give you what you deserve. Okay. Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Cups. I'm not really picking up that you and this masculine with twin flames though. And he's not going to pop out as no emperor until he get with you. That's also what I just heard. Because you're already out here as his match, technically. Ace of Pentacles, I'm telling you, you are his divine connection. You are his divine purpose. And he is not going to feel complete until he is with you. He will not embody this emperor energy until he makes the moves that he needs to make to have a future with you. King of Wands, Queen of Cups, Page of Pentacles. It came out Page of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, king of wands strength right behind this king of wands okay he knows that he can't he won't have this title bestowed upon him until he goes towards the woman that he loves and he gives her the offer that she deserves and it's going to take some effort to do that because of how he left the connection he's ashamed of something that he did here chariot but he's still pushing through regardless this is that no hesitation energy for sure because whoever he was with they don't compare to you honey okay they coming out as a five of pentacles at best you could be a taurus what else holy spirit the world and he trying to accomplish some sort of goal by coming towards you. I think you are a Taurus. Nine of Pentacles. This man was up under some sort of judgment now for rejecting you. And again, I'm not picking up that he tried to destroy your life or no shit like that. But his refusal to be with you and his attempt to go be with another that was enough to be up under judgment for. Because you are a divine counterpart. The divine counterpart. Ace of Pentacles. Mm. So whatever he chose to do to maneuver things in the favor of this other woman. That's what he was up under judgment for. That's what he's ashamed about. Because he knows that. It just ain't no comparison. He truly has discovered somehow 
I mean, these motherfuckers is waking up. Thank you, Holy Spirit. They waking up, y'all. They are waking up. Three of Wands. He got some sort of knowledge, intuitive knowledge, some foresight about who his, his ideal counterpart is. So you could be a twin flame. You definitely are his divine feminine. And he's coming in to revitalize the connection between the two of y'all, okay? This King of Wands, Aries energy. This is the second masculine, divine masculine. I done picked up on this. That's healing the connections with their divine feminine. Time heals just came on by Guapale. Time heals all things. And it's truly healed this man's heart. He's he's had a turnaround in his mindset. He knows who you are. He's ashamed that he even had you waiting this long, girl. Okay? Definitely for a cross watcher. We have the Eight of Cups and the Ten of Swords. Whatever he, whatever he was involved in that distracted him from this distraction, I can't make it up that distracted him from his divine connection and his divine purpose has been cut indefinitely. It's been cut indefinitely here. Anything else, Holy Spirit, for this Aries energy? We ain't got to stay here long, y'all. Y'all see it. Page of Wands. This man about to communicate that he know he invested in the wrong person. Queen of Pentacles, but he, he wants to fully invest in you moving forward. Are you going to accept the offer? Whoever this Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, Empress is, this is for you, baby. This message is for you, honey. Your divine masculine has woke up. However he woke up, he woke up. We ain't finna get into all of that. I'm not really picking up on no spell work or none of that shit. I ain't picking up that this third party was manipulating him. She just wasn't for him. And that don't mean that she can't be for somebody else either. But we have to get with people who are equally yoked and in alignment with who we are. If we want to have this type of energy that this Aries knows that he can have with you, that he's going to communicate to you, okay? You definitely are Taurus. All right, so I don't know how I'm going to post this on my page, but it will be available, okay? And if it doesn't apply, y'all, let it fly. Take only what resonates, leave the rest, and I'll be back soon with another one. Peace, y'all.